you guys and welcome back to another video i wanted to give you guys a quick update on my car so unfortunately my car is not able to be repaired um i haven't even looked at cars so i am stressing about that because i have to give up the rental very soon and i'm about to lose my mind because i'm gonna have no car i don't know if you guys have seen the prices of cars lately but even i'm not even trying to disrespect cars but even like the bad cars are expensive even the bad cars that, that it's just outrageous another unfortunate thing as you guys know i have a i have ulcerative colitis i have a whole video on it which is um irritable bowel disease i'm not trying to talk about it because it is what it is i have to live with it and i don't care if you think this is nasty then you're not my target audience i'm not trying to target anybody with ibd or any ibd related diseases this is just like grown people talking you know what i mean my insurance is just having a lot of problems finding the medication so they might have to switch me with something else and that's not how my body works and my gastroenterologist said that that's not gonna work so we're gonna have to try something new and it's just it's a lot for me because the way that uh, biotics works and i'm not even gonna get into the let me not get into the scientific stuff i can't get a new medication that's similar to the one i'm taking because i have our i will by then have already built antibodies so we have to switch to a whole completely different biologic which is let me just to a whole nother different medication so that sucks because it takes one to two months for you for your body to adjust and know if it works or not so during those two months it could be very trying it could be painful not painful well it's always painful but i'm used to it um it could be ineffective i guess that's what i'm trying to put it. it could be ineffective and it cannot work so those two months could be a waste and then i would have to get another medication or that would be two more months you know what i'm saying so it's just it's just a lot of trial and error and i found something that works and it just sucks that it's not gonna work anymore because they can't find it so i really should just live in canada with all the issues that i have but that's another story so yeah that's something else that's kind of keeping me up at night i'm sorry i haven't been uploading as much really at all i have just on top of all that i got sick i had to handle my business and i'm not gonna get on camera all snotty i'm just not i'm not no I'm not gonna do that i feel like i kind of sell stuffy right now but that's how i sound when i wake up so don't mind that um but soon we should be back to our regular schedule because I get disappointed in myself, you know. I I follow a lot of active YouTubers and you know, they're uploading every week and they have issues too, but they still they still keep going. They still keep going, so I have no excuse. I'm a regular person. Like my life is not all that. So I don't you know, there's no excuse. I've just really been under the weather, going through it and yeah i really do enjoy talking to y'all but i don't know if anybody else actually listens to me talk so y'all let me know if y'all like these little rants slash update update kind of videos or part of it this won't be the whole video trust me i know i know i talk too much oh did i mention my house is in shambles again no i did not bought a couple little trinkets and whatnot at the store real quick this morning so Bam, sharp cheddar cheese. I like this for my arepas, tacos, all that good stuff. Got some taxed eggs. Love it. I got some large bread. Bam. I also got some crystal light for the pitcher. You know, we on a budget. I'm telling y'all, this crystal light is actually better than what I thought it would be. I know it's crystal light, so you're like, ew, crystal light. I'm thinking, you know, less sugar. Yes, it's less sugar, and we're adults, so keep it real. Come on now. You don't want diabetes or none of that, so what's the other brand? Is it Kool-Aid? I think it's the Kool-Aid packs. Hey, this is actually really good. Trust me. Crystal light, get it. Make sure you get the one that says pitcher because last time I got the one that says bottle. So just watch out for that. Got two tomatoes because everything's taxed. So, and all this expires pretty quickly. So I, I, I'm trying to be considerate. Got some bacon. At this point, I don't even care anymore. Like I don't even pick the, the my favorite bacon because it's too taxed. So 
I just pick, I just look at the prices and pick what's cheapest. To be honest with y'all, I don't care. Y'all know I had to get my Texaroni. You know me, you know I love, not Texas, I love pasta. But hey, the Texaroni is cool. I don't know if we're the only state that does this, but I love it. Like, mm, makes the food yummier. <laughs> Go Texas. Then I got the basic assorted ones. Trio Itali Italiano. Got two avocados, which was one dollar and something. And last but not least, I got me some cottonette. Now, the only thing that I will not discuss or debate is toilet paper, especially when it comes to cottonette. Like, I don't care. I don't know about y'all, but I will not use any cheap toilet paper ever. Ever, ever, ever. Once I started using Cottonette, there was no going back for me. And honestly, I prefer the blue color because the purple one seems a little... What's the word? It just breaks easier. The blue one is stronger. It says ultra clean, but I would also say ultra strong. I know it says strong, clean, ripple. And you do use less, okay? I know it is pricey. Trust me, I know. I know. But it doesn't hurt my pockets because you know what? When I wipe... I feel like heaven. So you know what? To me, this is my splurge item. All right, y'all, it's been a couple hours later. And so right now, as you can hear, I'm doing my laundry, I'm making pasta. I like to add this parm cheese right here, it's Kraft parm cheese. But I also like to add this grated Parmesan cheese. I get both of these from Kroger. You can get these at your grocery store. I don't know if you can get them in other states, but this is what I can get at my grocery store. I love this. This is in the cheese aisle. Yep. Mm -hmm. I love this. I really, really love this cheese. If I get this, if I ever get this cheese, that means I'm splurging. Although this cheese is expensive too, but this will last me longer than this, as you guys can tell. So I use this not on special occasions because I don't have anybody over, but I use this for when I want that extra flavor. And I know you may think it's nasty combining these cheeses, but this, for me, this works. I have no complaints. I love it. Boom, pot is boiling. I'm gonna add however much texaroni I want. And then bam, we're just gonna let that cook for eight to 10 minutes and then you're done. I know it's bright in the kitchen, but this is what the texaroni looks like. I just added some butter. Hi guys, my battery's about to die. I just wanna wish you guys a happy 4th of July. Make sure you guys are being safe. Please, if you're gonna drink, have somebody else drive. Please, please, please be very careful. I know every day is like this, but you know, on holidays, it can get a little hectic. I'm um, not sure if I'm gonna vlog anything for 4th of July, but I did just wanna come in here and say happy 4th. Look how beautiful. Good morning, y'all. Sometimes you have to go out, buy some flowers for yourself because I feel like I'm too harsh on myself. So I have to remind myself that I love myself and I can get myself flowers. All right, y'all. So I got this box from Topicals. I wanted to open it on camera with you guys so if I can get this thing open. This is the brand Topicals. I struggle with dark circles and bags per se and i've had this problem ever since i was a little girl so it's just something it's just a problem that i've always had so it's not like oh get more sleep drink more water no the problem is not going away i've seen you know the before and after results obviously dark circles results it's not an overnight thing you have to keep doing it and honestly i do struggle with that as well like i've never really committed to a product unless it's like mascara or just something that i have to do every day which technically this is crucial. I should do this every day, but I don't know. I I even forget to take my vitamins, so I mean, I feel like vitamins are crucial, so I don't, I don't know. So I'm going to try my best to do this every day, 
So I got like a little bundle. This was $30, these three things. But it was better to do that than to just get the one thing that I wanted. So the one thing that I wanted, I think it's this right here. Yeah, so I wanted this. Might be too bright. But I wanted these uh, brightening, bright, brightening and cleaning eye masks. Now, I am a very skeptical person. I'm not, I'm, I've never been the type to get caught by advertisement or anything like it's hard for people to finesse me per se like i feel like a lot of people get finessed by little things that instagram throws at you or just any ads that come up i don't care how many times it, pop, it pops up like it's not gonna happen this i went out of my way to research and all that so hopefully it works um i would say I, i'll keep y'all updated but i don't know if i'll remember to keep y'all updated or if i'll remember to do this but i hope i i hope i do because i spent 30 dollars on it so you know you get a lot of get a lot of uh, under eye masks it says six pairs it says for under eye darkness and puffiness so what else what is this i got this little bundle came with this ingrown to tonic i don't know what the, a towel a little towel i don't know what it does it says soft and soothe this and reduces discomfort it caused by ingrown hairs not sure if i'll be using that and then i got the the brightening and clearing serum i think i already told y'all that but i already forgot it. do i think serums work skeptical <laughs> skeptical so i don't know but we'll see we'll see it's a little too fade the look at, of your most stubborn marks scars and spots so uh i don't know if i have anything i guess like something right here i have like a little i have like a little fade right here that's the only thing i can think of we shall see we shall see. I'm going to keep the box. Well, let me see if it says it on the... Yeah. I'm going to keep the box because I'm not going to remember what this is for. So, I'm going to keep the box so I can read the directions in the back again. Let's see if we got like a little coupon. Oh, we didn't get any coupon. Oh, they're vegan, dye-free, and cruelty-free. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, y'all. As you guys can see, I just put on the Topicals eye mask, whatever. So, they feel jelly like there's gel all in the packaging in the eye patch there's all there's gel and so it's very it's just a jelly type of substance it doesn't get on your fingers because it's in there it gets in here so it doesn't get on your fingers and so you remove it and it's very easy to move it around so you can just move it to however you want it to be i think this one's a little too high but whatever we'll we'll live i'm just gonna let that sit under my eyes i don't know how long you're supposed to do it but i'm gonna leave it under my eyes for a couple hours because that's what i want to do but these actually look so cute i'm not gonna lie these look really cute all right y'all it's been a couple hours later i did my makeup and this is what it's looking like what under eyes look like but the reason why i wear in my room is because i'm actually gonna fold laundry so if you have any laundry come on let's tackle it together i have a whole mountain of laundry i usually don't let it get this bad but we're here now so it is what it is let's go video here i am moving out pretty soon very soon talking next week uh very excited about that it's gonna be a bigger apartment a lot more room a lot more storage so you know what that means we're gonna go shopping so that's gonna be fun these next couple of videos coming up are gonna be a whole lot of 
moving and packing all that good stuff i don't know about you but i love that kind of content so i will definitely be putting out that content for you guys so stay tuned for that before you go make sure to give it a thumbs up like comment share subscribe if you want to if not hey that's okay and i'll see you guys next time bye